Hi, this is Victor. Welcome to Java Vic 5 and Season 3. Okay, so today I'm going to talk about how to use uh, Google Offline Maps to on your Android phone. Um, the in my case, um, I don't have data. The most of the time I don't really need it, and so it's just a more economical plan for me. But the one thing I do miss is the the map function. So then recently I discovered that I can use I can download a map from Google Maps and uh, have it on my phone as an offline and then I don't need data and I can still use the maps. So I'm going to show you how to set that up. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to use my tablet, my this one here, the um, Samsung tablet right here, uh, only because I have an old phone. It's about uh, two and a half years old and it's really slow. So this will work much better. But it works the same way as if it's Android because what the tablet is Android 4.4 KitKat. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is to go to your maps function and open up maps. So we'll open up, we're gonna open up maps and there we have maps opened up. So then we're gonna go to the menu and if you look at the menu over here there is um, an offline there offline maps so you go to offline maps and click on that and and then you do um, select your map so when you select your map it's going to go to a section so I'm going to use Vancouver as an area and I'm just going to uh, increase that a bit and just go right there and do that so as you can see it's got a selection right there okay so of course you can go down or up you know you can increase the of course if it increases it's more space so once i've got that down okay then over here it says download click on download and as you can see it's going to start downloading the map um so yes <laughs> okay so it's downloading the map i'm not sure how long it'll take it'll probably take a few minutes uh so there it is and it's uh actually going pretty fast as you can see uh there it is i'm not sure why it's downloading too maybe i pressed it twice so anyway it's downloading um, I must have pressed it twice, but anyway, still going. Well, one's going faster than the other. See this one, map four, sixty-one percent is downloaded, and there it is, almost seventy. So, I actually tried it on my phone, and it does work really well. The uh, the once it's downloaded, then all it's, all you have to do is just go to maps again and go to your downloaded maps and look it up and there it is and the cool thing with the phone is even though i don't have data because the phone has gps it'll still show my location on the map relative to my downloaded map so that's kind of cool okay so the it's almost there at uh 80 91 percent and it's done almost uh, there it is okay so now the it has this December 24 unless ex, unless uh, expires unless uh, updated so what I'm thinking about is that I'm not sure what's gonna happen I have to check and see in December either it's going to delete um, if I don't update it via Wi-Fi or nothing will happen <laughs> okay so, uh, so then we go back to um, our our maps. Okay, I'm going to close the um, the application. So, and then I'm going to start it up. Okay, so I'm going to start it up right there. Okay, so it's going to start up, and I'm going to go to the menu. Then you go again to offline maps. See uh, right there, offline maps. Uh, okay, right there. And now you can select the map that you picked. So I'm going to pick, I'm not sure what this one is, but let's pick that one. 
And of course, since I'm on Wi-Fi, so it'll say update, but I don't need to update it. So I'm going to go on this. And there it is. And then, of course, I can zoom in. There it is. Keep going zoom. Oops. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> it kind of moved things around. Where did it go? Um, oh, there it is. Okay, so zoom up. Zoom up. Uh, zoom up. Until we get to the street level. Zoom up. And it'll populate with the names. As you can see. Okay. And so uh, that's basically how you uh, use Google Maps offline. So it's actually really easy to use. And you can like take sections. And like I said, the bigger the area, the more space it uses when you download. Okay, so thank you for watching. Have a great day and see you in my next episode. Okay, bye-bye.